The sciatic nerve exits the pelvis through the greater sciatic notch. It travels under the piriformis muscle. It continues its course posterior to the obturator internus, gemelli, and further caudally, the quadratus femoris. It is accompanied by the inferior gluteal vessels and is close to the ischial tuberosity in the subgluteal area. In the cross-sectional view taken at the level of the symphysis pubis, the top of the picture represents the anterior surface of the body. The symphysis pubis is seen as two pinkish rectangular structures. The spermatic cord is seen anterior to the symphysis pubis. The bulky muscle covering the posterior surface on either side is the gluteus maximus. The hip joint with the head of the femur in it is seen as a round pale structure on either side. The hip capsule is seen as a shiny ligamentous structure surrounding the head. The ischial tuberosity is seen as a triangular pinkish bony structure on either side. The muscle seen inside the pelvic wall and extending laterally behind the hip joint is the obturator internus. The sciatic nerve is seen as a whitish flat structure under the mid portion of the gluteus maximus and the obturator internus. One can see the inferior gluteal vessels accompanying the sciatic nerve. If the cross sections are done further caudally, the obturator internus between the sciatic nerve and the hip capsule will be replaced by the gemelli or the quadratus femoris.